Hey, and welcome back, you guys, to Find Feminine Masculine. I hope you guys are listening well on today. Let us see what, um, what's going on with you guys. So I was picking up that somebody was trying to rewrite your story. It's not your story, okay? Like whatever, whatever, um, excuse me, spiritual birth confirmation. It's like um, somebody's trying to rewrite your story. But that's not your story. You're getting rid of things that do not serve your purpose. Like you are completely walking away from things that don't have anything to do with you anymore. Angel of Love Reverse. I keep picking up on this energy of somebody wanting you to work, 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 like just and get nothing in return. I'm going to read these in the upright, okay? Angel of Love, Archangel Michael. Somebody wants you to, I've seen 111, like they, they literally want you to work and get nothing for it. Somebody is so jealous of someone in this energy. Goodness gracious, all this damn jealousy, bro. It's like somebody just cannot let something, just they can't let something be. Broken heart, storm warning. Like they're refusing, whoever this is, is refusing to let something just be. Or this could be you. Like you're not allowing something to just take its course or something like that. Like somebody is doing too much. Victory. Archangel Gabriel. I'm picking up on a lot of itching, like your hair or something like, or your just skin or something. Somebody is just itchy all over. Somebody could have gotten bitten by something as well. Y'all be careful, fam, masculine. Like, be extremely careful, okay? Like, I don't know what this could be. Angel of Balance. Strategy. Something is meant for you to just go off or something or just get very irritated. Don't, like, don't get irritated. It's no need for you to get irritated. Like, when you get irritated, it seems like if you get irritated with something, it's going to cause a tower. But I feel like that's what somebody wants. Yeah, yang. Yeah. Mm. That's what somebody wants. They want a tower to happen. They want something very bad to happen to you, door to spirit. Like they want you to have a sudden loss. Like a sudden loss for love or like just being so irritated that you don't want to be bothered with anyone. I mean, you can always take a break from people. You dig a rescue? Like you can take a break from people. You can take a break from things. Like you can always take a break, but it's like somebody wants you to be completely fed up that you walk away from something that's meant to be for you. That's the truth, Aru. That's the truth. I seen three thirty three. Something that's just meant for you. They want you to walk away from it. Whoever this person is, they have no self control. Somebody is, is, they look at you for everything, like they do. And this is not for inspiration. They just watch everything you're doing to copy this, but to steal something from you. Round and round, never ending story. This is a never ending story with whoever this is. It's like they do the same thing, it's the same tech, it's the same shit. Between worlds, this is a lot of negative energy being sent to somebody. I mean, I'm picking up on some heavy negative ass energy because all you do is just be happy. It's like they, they don't want you to have happy thoughts or something. This person's main goal is to make sure you're focused on only the things that are not going right or something. When you should be showing gratitude. Like you should be showing gratitude for whatever. And they want you to feel like you don't have anything because it may not be exactly what you want or something, fork in the road. 
somebody's also ordering some and you're going to get something completely different than what you ordered and that's supposed to like irritate you to where you're just like manifesting more bad shit to happen or something message in a bottle so somebody's trying to contact you as well they want to talk to you but you don't want to talk to them it's a faded event this person needs to talk to you though it's like well they or they feel they need to i don't feel any urgency here i don't feel like you need to talk to you i don't feel like anything that they're talking about is going to benefit you in any kind of way this is for their own self-satisfaction or something or something that they feel like they can get out of some shit if they talk to you. If they bring something to your attention, they feel like they can get out of something and they're not. Or something like that. Seem like, I don't know what this is. It's like somebody wants to break the ice, break the silence between you two or something. Because they're getting a shit flexible. This person is in a, a, a situation that they cannot get out of to the sea. They can't get out of whatever this is. So they're trying to sneak their way through now. They want you to pray for them. They want you to speak good things in their life so that they can regenerate something else only to still treat you like you're not shit. And it's not, you don't deserve that fam masculine. I'm just saying that's what, the, this person does not view you as valued. Or they don't want to recognize your value. They don't want to give you your props or anything. Orphan, a leg up. You know this already, so you know to stay far away from whoever this is. Like, you know to stay far, far away from this person. Shrek could be significant observer. They're watching everything you're doing. They can't stop watching is what I heard. Building blocks, peace, thinker, loyal heart. They like, oh, I can't find nobody else like this. So this could be a scorned ass lover. This could be somebody that is scorned. Somebody that is not going to get over something in any amount of time. Like, they're never going to get over something. This person is so unhealed. It's a shame. I think could be Shana or Shane. Jane, Jana, Janice or Jeanette, Janiqua, Jakia or Takia. Somebody last name is Stone, S T O N E. Discontent and boredom. This person be having a good time sending this shit to you. Somebody name could be JJ. What's this hope, firm foundation, third eye chakra? Yeah, you see something coming clearly. Like you see something before it even happens. And it's like, you're gonna see something. It's like final destination kind of shit. It's like, you're gonna literally see something happen before it happens. And you're gonna be floored. You're gonna be like, what in the world? Like I knew that was gonna happen or something like that, or that could have happened recently. Foundation and achievements, recognition and reward, patience and planning in the reverse. Your whole bloodline is royal is what I heard. They may not live up to their true potential, but you're all royalty. Everybody in your family has a certain mission. And it's like everybody is getting in line, but something is solely surrounding you. So you could be the first of your family. Choose wisely, you were chosen. So you could be the first of your family to receive something or to do something. Wow. June 19th, July 19th. So whoever this loser is, this, this person that constantly is in your fucking business, they're sitting around waiting for something to end for you because they had sent out this negative energy. So they like, okay, all I got to do is watch it manifest. So the place to shock reverse is not going to happen though. This person is so damn confident that something is going to end for you. This person has literally started betting money or something. Like they started putting money into shit. Like this person is literally celebrating something too soon. Fulfillment of wishes reverse. Like I'm picking up on somebody that's celebrating a loss. Like too damn soon. They may be trying to love bomb you or some trauma bomb. Come in rushing at them like they love you or some shit. Because you're in your destiny very quickly. Something is happening for you. And this person is in the shadows and they're about to come out and say something because something ain't working. Or they may just be trying to get close to you to see if something is working. It's like somebody wants to get down to the nitty gritty. Like they don't, they don't care about what it is that they're seeing, obviously with their own eyes. This motherfucker right here, they want to make sure that they can get in your business and actually see something going down. 
They want to make sure whatever they did to you is affecting you or something like that. Like they want to directly see this happen. They don't want to hear about it. This person wants to see it. They want to see this shit. They want to make sure that they're front and center. That's why they're trying to come in acting like they fuck with you or something. They want to be front and fucking center to make sure that something is uh, ending for you. Just period. And if they cannot see this happen, they're going to make sure that they can see it. They need to see this. They need to have proof of some. I heard show uh, send me a picture of the body. <laughs> like somebody could have hired a hitman or something. Somebody getting set up. Somebody about to go. There's going to be another viral story of somebody trying to pay someone to take their husband or their wife out. Or their sister or their brother or their mom. Or dad or something like that. Distant Horizons or their child. Somebody was foolish enough to pay somebody to take someone out. Yeah, they're going to end up in despair. So somebody needs to see proof of something. They need proof. Somebody also lost something or somebody and somebody's making like funeral arrangements or something and somebody needs to see like a death certificate, like a proof of something or somebody needs to see like a marriage certificate or something. Change, child. So it could be also children that's in despair for whatever this is. You look, I'm telling you, this person is expected for something to fall completely for you because of something that they did. They did some kind of work, but I've been telling everybody that this magic ain't working. Marriage, mature woman. And you got an official person at the bottom of the deck. Like whatever this is, like this, this moon spell that they did, it's not going to work. It's like you, you are working against this magic or something. Something is working against this magic. Look. You're, you're working. You got a gift of being able to shut all of this down. This is not going to go how somebody thought. Wow. I mean, what did they truly think is what I'm feeling like. Like, what the heck? Like, you really thought you were going to take this person out with some damn moon magic? Fuck. This person is in poverty, or they will be. This person thought that they had something all figured out, and they don't. Yeah, and they're concerned about this now. This definitely could be a family dynamic. Either way, somebody is concerned. They're concerned that something is not going through. That's why they need to see something with their own eyes. It's something that somebody doesn't believe as well. Like somebody may hear something about you like, oh yeah, you know, they got a raise or, you know, they they uh starring on this TV show. They like, oh, I need to see it for myself. I don't believe you. I need to see that. Somebody needs to be up close and personal watching something. Two, 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 three, three. 21, 22. So 2020, 2020 through 2023 is significant. Like these last three years of your life is very significant. You could have had an awakening. You could have started walking your path in the last three years. Like you could have had a major tower happen in your life. And it's something that was set up that way in order for you to get where you are right now and where you're going. What I said, fam, masculine. You're always going to, you are always going to be led to go this way. It doesn't matter. This is your, your correct path. Somebody wants you to feel like you're doing something wrong. Like you picked the wrong path. You did it. Well, at least you got options. What I said, child, you got options to pick and choose whatever it is you want to do. But somebody didn't want you to have those op um, options or something. They didn't want you to have offers. They did not want you to have these damn offers here. Six of Pentacles, what goes around comes back around. So all of the good deeds that you've done is coming back to you 10 times fold. Like something is coming right back to you. And very quickly with the King of um, Knight of Wands, there's the Ace of Swords, the truth. Like it's coming back to you in a major way from some kind of betrayal. But everything is fine. It's like this person did all of this shit to you and then they sat back seeing if something was working and it's not. Or they sent people in to do a certain task and they did not complete some shit. Even if they attempted to, they were not able to complete successfully. That's the truth. They were not able to successfully destroy you. And this person is like, okay, so if you did that, why don't I see something? Like, why can't I see this person take a fall? Like, where's the fall? Where's the work that you did? This money that I'm paying you. Something got slowed down and returned back. Where, okay, all this money that I've spent and, and gave y'all money and paying y'all fucking bills and shit. Where the fuck? Like, this person is not under judgment yet. 
what do you mean? Like this person is still, they still alive. They're still alive. I want this person gone. Page of Swords reversed. This person is trying to collect some kind of evidence of your downfall. You don't have one. Somebody could have even lied to this person and said that something happened and it didn't. Like, okay, well, show me. Show me. Show me that you actually did what I paid you to do. And this person cannot show because they didn't do what the fuck they were paid to do. Nothing that they did worked on you. Look at the Ten of Swords. These are a bunch of con artists that y'all are dealing with. Goodness gracious, where are all these people? And why do I feel like you don't even know these people? Seven of Swords with the star, you don't even know these idiots. You literally don't even know these people or something. What else is here? What is this Ten of Swords? You don't even know these people. And this, this could be a family dynamic, but it don't gotta be your family, but it's a family of people. And this could also be your family, Four of Pentacles, trying to hold you back from something. What else is here? Eight of Cups, you walked away. Something is slowly growing as well. Something is growing and you don't even understand how much it's growing. Like it may appear, like something may appear to be one way, but it's truly another way, Nine of Swords. It's like something appears to be a certain way, but it's not that way at all. Okay, Ten of Wands. Somebody is really suffering from something that they said or that they did, period. It didn't go in their favor or it won't. And they're so upset about this. You, What you mean you could not get them to, you know, give up or something? Like, what do you mean this person is still getting this opportunity? Didn't I tell you um, to make sure that this person does not move forward? What am I paying you for? I'm really hearing somebody arguing. Like, they're really not understanding how something is still going in your favor. That is crazy. This King of Pentacles be paying people. Why haven't they given up yet? What do you mean they still got their gifts? How is this person still abundant? Why are they still sane? Three of Swords. This person is broken hearted about this. How are they still sane? Why are they still able to function? I'm just hearing that. So this person is coming into your life to try to talk or whatever the fuck this is, but they're trying to act like they're on your side and they're not. It could be a Leo. They're trying to act like on your they're on your side. They're truly not. This person is very much against you. Taurus energy. Why do I feel like this person has signed up for some shit as well that they cannot get out of some kind of brotherhood or sisterhood? Like they've involved themselves in something and they can't get out and they need to use you as a sacrifice to get out of something. So it's like they're trying to make something right, but within this group, they're not trying to make it right with you or for you. They're trying to make something right for themselves because whatever they did, it's not working in their favor. They're not getting the benefits of something. Five of Cups, they're sad now. And then look at this person in the tower. Two of Wands, that's what they're waiting on, a damn tower. Wow. Like, I can't believe you lied, or I can't believe you were not able to do this. I can't believe this. They're still in the Six of Wands. This person is sane. It's something about you being sane. Like, somebody wanted to drive you crazy. Eight of Swords reversed with the Fool card. What do you mean they still taking leaps of faith? What are you talking about? You didn't do anything I said do. Look at this, magician. I thought you told me that I needed to buy these uh, ingredients. I needed to get all of this stuff. You made me spend money and this person is still sane. Somebody wants you to go fucking crazy. They wanted you to be left out in the cold. Like even if you did lose something, you still got your mind. They didn't want you to have a mind. They wanted you to lose your mind. Ten of Cups, like I said, a family dynamic. Wow, bro, this is just so low down. Somebody really thought that they were going to come up off of your energy, off of making you lose your mind. Yeah, moon card, something is being revealed about this magic. This person did something in secret, but the secrets are coming out. The sun and the moon is in the reverse. They're not able to hide or eclipse anything. Yep, the Three of Cups. It's going to be revealed that this third party, whoever this group is, that this person has submitted themselves to, like, they won't go and submit their life to God, but they'll go and submit their life to some low vibing ass motherfucking occult or something. But they see that this, this Queen of Cups is not taking on this devil energy. 
They thought that this devil energy was going to consume you, like literally take over your life. Wow. You're the boss. Wow, these people have really lost their mind. I heard canopy, so a canopy bed could be significant. It's like somebody wanted you stuck, bound, and trapped, fed up, like to the point where you literally lost your mind. I mean, so many things just happening over and over again that you're just wasting your time doing something or whatever. I don't know. Somebody wanted you really to feel like you were not doing the right thing or whatever the case is. These folks is getting bad karma, bro. They paying karma heavily for this. And it's like they never understand why. They can never think of a reason to why something ain't working. And they don't want to wait. Like, this, this, these people have no patience. It's something about you just being way different from everybody else and nobody can block that. Look, somebody wants you back now because they see you're stronger than them. This is the only reason why this motherfucker is coming back towards you. They just see that you're stronger. They can't beat you. They can't force anything to go wrong in your life. And even if it was going wrong, they can't force you to lose your mind. I'm telling you, somebody wanted you to lose your mind. They're truly a groupie. All they do is watch everything you fucking do. This person's not going to be able to stalk you anymore either. Look at this stalker reverse coming out on the page of swords reverse. <laughs> yeah. This motherfucker thought they had something set in stone for you. They, they really thought that they had a plan. Nah, bitch. And then this dirt digging card is in the reverse looking you up. They trying to dig dirt, but they can't find what the fuck they're looking for. They still mad because you got a love offer here. Somebody been mad about this shit since the day they started stalking you is what I heard. Somebody really knows, like they know for sure that you have a spiritual union here and they're extra triggered about this, the fact that somebody actually loves you for who you are. They're also upset because there's an impersonator that was trying to infiltrate your energy and this person wasn't able to do it. It's like this person was literally trying their hardest to give off the energy of divine feminine when they're truly a spiritual hater. They don't believe in anything that you believe in. Somebody wanted somebody to walk in your energy for you. And they were mad. They mad because they couldn't do it. They wanted you to lose your mind so that this person could step up. And what the fuck kind of mind does this bitch have to think that there's someone else? 2222, 22, bitch, you done lost your mind. What I said, child? This person done lost their mind off the damn bat. Like, this person, by default, done lost their damn mind. They literally thought that they were going to be you. Like, they were going to live as you. But let's run them crazy and then I'll step up and be them. Bitch, please. What else is here? They're not running shit. And somebody's mad because you're not running. You're not afraid. Screenshots. Somebody wants you to be living in fear. They literally want you to be scared of something. You're not. Their head is in the clouds like, bro, come on, bro. Like, what, what did I give you all of that damn money for? Like, I paid you all that money and you was not able to deliver. Somebody about to lose their vehicle. They could be doing spell work over your car. I don't feel like you're going to lose your car. They're going to end up losing theirs. It's like they want to have a car, but they don't want you to have one. What kind of shit is that? They want they want to have a home, but they don't want you to have one. They want to have a job. They don't want you to have one. What the fuck? What the hell you thought this was? This is crazy. Like somebody really thinks that they're getting revenge on you or something. This person feels like you owe them something. They feel like you did something to them or they lost something because of you. So they're coming in to steal everything from you. But think it's in the reverse. They're not going to be able to get their hands on this here. Whatever the hell they thought. Yeah, you're not blocked. Blocked is in the reverse. But they were trying to block you. It's like they tried to block you, but now they're blocked. They may be caught blocking a relationship or something too. Somebody said a lot of foul fucked up shit about you, fam. Masculine. Yeah. Because they didn't want you to marry into this wealthy family. Somebody also called child services on somebody. They backfired too. They thought by getting your kids taken from you, that was going to drive you crazy or something, but you never got your kids taken or something? Like, what the hell? Somebody really wants you to be insane, because they are. Or they want you to be crazy so that they can steal something from you, and they're confused why this is not working. They're confused. They're literally scratching their head, like, hold up now, what went wrong? So they're blaming each other. This whole group is fighting, and they're like, well, somebody need to go. Somebody need to go in towards that feminine or that masculine. Like, you need to go towards them. I want my money's worth. You need to go and you need to do what I told you to do. I want to see them fall. 
hustling in the reverse. I want to see them fall because I don't like the way that they're so fucking happy. They shouldn't be happy. They stole my man. They stole my girl. They stole my life. They stole something from me. So they don't need to be happy. You didn't steal shit from this person. This person is not shit fuck hell. Or this is you. You didn't steal anything from this person. This person is just confused. They don't know what the hell they're doing. They don't. This person don't even know why they want to take everything from you. They just made you a target. They just don't like you. And the offer that's coming towards you. They just simply don't like you. Like they can't hang with us. They can't be up here with us. Like you could literally have some offer coming to you that's gonna put you in a way better position. And they like, well, they can't work here. I don't want them working in this department or something like that. So they vowed to destroy you. <laughs> yeah. What else is there? Yeah, they were wasting their time. Now they're stuck limited with no changes. And the time is running out. It could be something about an hourglass here. Somebody sitting on their fucking high horse and they're going to jump off that bitch. They ain't going to get knocked off. They're going to jump off of it. They ain't even going to want to ride the horse no more. <laughs> this person going to be, because the way that the horse is going, this person is like, oh shit, what's ahead of me? I ain't ready for that. I'm jump, I'm trying to jump off this motherfucker. Let that horse keep going. Because that horse ain't turning around. That horse going to keep moving, baby. I'm seeing a horse in motion. And the shit, the horse might throw them up <laughs> The horse might throw this person off of it. Haters are gang stalking. I cannot make this up. Look, wasting time. Just, just some kind of way shifted, but whatever. They were wasting time with this. These haters are gang stalking y'all people, bruh. Like every single day, they make sure to come and watch something you're doing. They got to. And you will witness their karma. Whoever these people is, that card came out in another reading. They're sending you the evil eye as well. All of this stuff that they're doing, this evil eye energy is because you're still sane. It is something about you losing your fucking mind. Like somebody literally wants you to lose your mind. They want you to be completely insane by, you know, life and things that have happened. They're in their head because they feel like you one up them. Now they're going insane. Now they're going fucking crazy because they don't know how you're not crazy. The energy work you did on yourself is working. This is just simply you transmuting this negative ass bullshit. The work that you did is working. Somebody thought they were going to step up and be in your spot. Look, they try once to tarnish your reputation. I just said this, didn't I? They really, whoever these people is, they really try to ruin something for you. But it's one person more than the other that's very invested on your down. Like you don't have a downfall. Even if something may appear to not be going right right now, it's going to get better. Look, personality disorder. They don't know how to be themselves. This is what I'm saying. This person was, they constantly compare themselves to you. They like, why is that person not crazy? Because you're crazy. They want you to be exactly like them. You're not crazy. They see you getting all this love and can't stand it. They do not like when people be complimenting you when they gift you things. Anytime you get some kind of, bro, if you know, and I told y'all this the other, um, in another reading before, if you notice, like when you go live and shit, or when you post a video, you will immediately start feeling negative ass energy. It's because this person is in your energy watching everything you do. And they immediately start sending magic at you. They be sitting in your comments, fake like, supporting you like they really truly fuck with you and they don't. They be in your comments because they want to act like they're a part of the crowd is what I heard. But they're really in the crowd trying to make sure that you have a loss. They're in your energy sending you like some low down shit. And then try to play the fucking victim when they start losing everything around them. Their finances will perish. Whoever trying to fuck with somebody's money and his energy like that's the lamest shit you can do, baby. You are going to pay for that. They at least talking about you are going to continue to thrive on these haters is what Firewitch Tarot said, child. They're happy, happy over your fuck-ups, too. Like, if something messed up for you, like, if something slowed down, excuse me, for one second, this person was jumping for joy. They were so excited about this here. But now they ain't got much to be excited about. Sending hate emails. Somebody could obviously just start sending some hateful emails. Look, spying on you as part of their daily routine, child. Mm -mm. Somebody gets mad at you because you just don't stop. Like, you don't quit. It's not in your DNA. You're not a loser. They want you to mention them to gain clout. Tapping into your energy is their addiction. Yeah. 
This, these people do this shit very often. Why are they not falling? <laughs> I'm just hearing it. <laughs> like, why haven't they failed? What are you talking about? Why is this person still alive? Why are they still happy? I ruined everything for them. I took all of their shit. I, I did this and I did that. Bitch, you thought you did. They don't even understand where your true joy comes from, the Lord, bro. They can't take that from you. It doesn't matter if you got nothing in your pocket. And you're about to be leveled up because these hoes and niggas are unreliable. You're going to the next level. You're a boss. You're either about to take your finances to the next level or it's time that you do. If your finances haven't improved yet, you can be certain they will soon. There's a chance of something extra in the air. This is what I'm saying. They don't want you to be, oh, they can't sit with us. Bitch, you can't sit with me. What are you talking about, bitch? Like, nigga, what are you talking about? You can't sit with us, bitch. What are you saying? They can't be here. Who are they? They can't be here. They were a drug addict. They sold drugs. They're homeless. They can't be here with us. They don't have any knowledge. They're not smart. Look at how they look. Their hair is not our texture. These are some racist motherfuckers. That's out to get whoever you are. They really want something to end for you and it's not going to. God said no. I feel like my dad tired of these people. He leveling you up just because he's sick of them. These other niggas really believe that they in these high positions or they better than somebody else. No, it's about to be you that comes in to take over. What else is here? You're you're literally about to come in and take over. Look, your ancestors said, yeah, baby. I don't know what they thought, but they thought fucking wrong. It's time for your generation. It's, it's your generation's time or something or something about your bloodline, your lineage. Somebody don't know who is protecting you in the spirit. These people love going in the spirit doing shit, but they don't know who it is protecting you, okay? I'm going to leave it here. Remember that God loves you and so do I.